So you've decided to play the game of the real estate market. Now, what exactly is the real estate market and what kind of game is it? Well, one of the things which I always do with my own children is to play the game of Monopoly. Now, the reason that I do that is because I always tell them that life is very much like Monopoly and the real estate game is exactly what Monopoly is. Given that you have up to six players and say, for example, everybody does 15 to 20 rounds and they throw the dice 100 times. On the average, everybody is throwing about the same number in total and they will be on the same round. Yet, always there will be one person who wins very, very badly and there's one who will lose very, very badly. Now, why is that the case? Well, on the one hand, the only problem with Monopoly is that everyone has the same salary. Now, we do know that in the actual real world, that's not the case. But there are a few things about the game which are very consistent with the real estate market as well. For example, the areas that you land on and everybody knows that Broadway is going to give you much more rent than say a utility station, all right? So now, just like playing the game of Monopoly, there are some specific rules to follow in order to get the right property at the right time. Now, the rules of the game will be dependent on who you are what your individual tastes are and what type of investment you are looking for. However, before you even start to roll the dice, you'll want to make sure that you know the basics of this game. One of the basics that you'll want to know is to decide on what it takes to find the right real estate market. You can use several marketing strategies that will help you find the right home, the right place to make the right type of investment within the market. Of course, while you're doing this, you will want to investigate the various areas that you're looking into and how they are connected to the community. This will allow you to find what will profit you with the investment in the long run. Now, just like Monopoly, you will want to understand that the area that you will be in and how it's going to be affected by the rules of that area. For example, everyone knows that investing in um, commercial properties or even industrial properties is a different ball game from your residential properties. There are different taxes involved and there are different purchasing methods to purchase commercial properties, whether it being as an individual or if you are a company purchasing it. So these same rules also applies to finding what is available in the real estate market. You will want to know the area and how it will affect your profits and the way of living or renting the area in the future. Now this can be examined by the demographics, the history of the area and the flow of people that are moving in and out of that area. So after you have investigated all these various things, you will be able to decide on where is the right place to purchase into and when is the right time to buy. And if this meets your criteria, you can actually get very, very good deals of the market despite the time of the year or the time of the property cycle. You will be able to get very, very good deals. You don't have to depend on throwing a dice. Now, if you're not too sure about how to go about doing this, you can always give me a call. I'm here to help you. My name is Arun and my number is 98487880. Thank you very much for watching and see you soon. Hey, thank you very much for watching. So now go on ahead, press that like button. Mm, that one, yes, right there. Ooh, you like it, don't you? Okay, now go and hit the subscribe button. That's right, you can do it. Mm, feels real good, right? And go on and hit the notification button so that you will always know when my next video is ready. You can do it. Go ahead. Mm. Bye-bye now.